Hello Debaters. It's Tips and Turtle Mix Wednesday. Today I'm gonna be focusing on all of you heavy Excel users. Here's what we're gonna see. So let me quickly show you the final result. Whenever you open a new Excel sheet, it will be automatically stylized like this. Let's get into it. Here's Here's the default Excel behavior. Whenever you open a new sheet with Ctrl N and a shortcut, it opens a new blank sheet. Now, we don't want to do this. We want to be more efficient. Uh, so, let's, let's stylize one sheet in a desired format. I will start by reducing the size of the first column. Like that. Next, I'm going to place a title. So let's just say title, subtitle, because each table should be named. And then I would write column 1, column 2, and column 3. These are all placeholders, right? Let's also change the font size of the title to be a bit bigger. And also change the color of the text. Bold it a bit. Uh, also for the columns, I'm going to bold them, and a final touch would be to add a thick bottom border. Note that right now it's black, so I'm going to also change its color with the line color. That's a bit out of the screen, but you get the point. And um, I have to apply it once again, and I'm almost ready. Finally, something I would like to do is to remove the grid lines. That's not always a good idea, but I like it better. Finally, let's also freeze all the top panes. Great. Now, whenever I scroll, the top four rows will stay the same. And that's about it. Now, how are we going to make this stylized sheet our default one? Well, first of all, we have to save it. We go to File, Save As. And then, then we save it on the desktop with the title book. And the file type should be an Excel template that has the extension XLTX. Right, let's save it on the desktop so that we have a quick access to it. Note that it still doesn't work, so if I click Ctrl and N and create a new sheet, it, it's not working, right? Well, that's because we have to save the template in one particular location. Alright, so we have to go to this PC, C, then you find Users, select the user that you're using right now, in my case, Ilya, then you go to App, Data, Roaming, then you find Microsoft from there, and then Microsoft you go to Excel, and then the Excel Start folder. This is the default folder which Excel uses every time it starts. If there is a template over there, it's gonna start it. Now I go to my desktop, I copy the template that I just created and paste it in this folder. From this moment on, every time I create a blank worksheet, it's simply gonna load this template and you can see it's fully functional just the way I want it to be. Now, how and where can I use this idea? Well, look at this for instance, our podcast expense spreadsheet. I, I have created it using this template exactly and I have saved a bunch of time. So that was the trick for today. I hope you liked it. And I have placed a comment in the comment section with the book that I have created in this video and the file path where you should be copying it. Thanks so much and until next time.